I'm about to leave um, my room. But this has just been such a long semester. <laughs> and I've just been waiting for it to be over now that it is. And this is not how I expect it to be over. Um, but <laughs> this makes a lot of sense um, for how it would end. Um, that's the plot, I guess. <laughs> um, but I'm just, I'm grateful. I'm, I'm so, I, I like, that's not even right, like, enough. Each semester, I usually make a video summarizing all of my favorite parts. But unfortunately, I took a break from filming and simply just don't have the footage to produce it. But despite that, I still wanted to create something to bookmark where I'm at during this current moment. Because this semester has left me to do a lot of thinking. Although they weren't caught on camera, my gratitude for the moments I had with those I love this semester still remained. My life was still touched by those around me in a way that made the world stop, that made it feel like the universe was simply just giving me a hug. I don't exactly know how to explain this feeling, because although it stems from my interactions with those around me, I still feel its warmth in times of solitude. It's this feeling where my heart feels sweet and my stomach feels full. My best description of this feeling is infinite gratitude and love for the people, moments, and things left unthanked although the appreciation for them is ever flowing. I believe the art of connecting with people is a lost art. That's why I think the best compliment I was ever given wasn't even directed towards me. The best compliment I was ever given was when I was once told that I'm always found surrounded by good people. People who are welcoming and make you feel comfortable the second that you step into their circle. People who take care of those around them. People who you know you're gonna smile at the moment that they crack a stupid joke that probably wasn't even funny, but for some reason you still find yourself laughing. Or you feel like you've known them for years, even though it's only been months, maybe even weeks or days or hours. People who tend to leave a little bit of love trailing behind them every step of the way. It's been said that you're a mosaic of people around you, but my favorite part of that metaphor is that the mosaic is never complete and it can always be changed. Our pieces are constantly being rearranged by those stepping into our existence. Those small steps into our now impact us forever. Or maybe not. Yet until you take a step back and admire how your mosaic came to be by the lives of those who mean the most to you, I don't think you can truly understand its beauty. But that's the thing with duality. Without the influential moments with those around us, our time in silence would be nothing. The best compliment I ever received wasn't directed towards me. That's why I just want to say thank you with this silly little video to those who made this semester a good one. I'm thankful that my mosaic is not fixed in place because it allows for more lessons, love, and experiences to come from tomorrow. It allows for me to perfect the art of connection and hopefully give my friends and family what they have given me. Because tomorrow holds hope, peace, and growth. But above all, Tomorrow holds infinite potential. And because of that, I think I'm going to need to take three. This one's for the homies, cause they really know me. <laughs> and I'll always come back whenever I'm lonely. So let's pull another for us and the homies. Cause I'm on the road now, but I miss the home team. Damn, I That's a wrap. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even in it.